Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. After you have opened an image file, you can place additional images into their own separate layers on top of the original image layer. An image file in Elements can consist of multiple layers. A layer is like a transparent sheet which is placed on top of the original canvas or background layer. You place additional images and other items into their own separate layers on top of the original image layer so that you can select a certain layer and then make changes to only the items within that particular layer without placing the parts of the image that exist within other layers in any risk. When you place a file into an existing image, it will be inserted into its own separate layer in the image. After you place a file, it will be rasterized. That is, any vector images within it will be converted into bitmap format. It will also be rasterized at the pixel resolution of the file into which it is placed. To place a file, first open the image into which you want to place the artwork. Then select File and choose the Place command from the menu bar to open the Place dialog box. You use this dialog box to navigate to the image file that you want to place into the existing image. Select the image file within this dialog box after you locate it, and then click the Place button in the dialog box to place the artwork into a layer in your open image file. If you are placing a PDF document with multiple pages into an image file, you will have to select which page you wish to place into the image within the dialog box that appears, and then click the OK button. The file is placed into a bounding box in the center of the open image. You can click inside the bounding box and drag the file around to change its placement. You can also resize it by placing your mouse pointer over one of the resizing handles located around the border of the file, and then clicking and dragging to resize the file. You can rotate it by placing your mouse pointer outside of the bounding box until you see a rotating arrow icon. Then click and drag to rotate the file. You can then click the check mark to commit the changes that you've made, or click the cancel button next to the check mark in order to cancel the entire placement. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.